It's Gail Sibley at the IAPS convention in Albuquerque, and I'm with Alan Flatman. Alan, you've taken a trip to China. Can you tell us a little bit about what that was like? Okay, actually, I've taken three trips to China, three years in a row, and it was, they have been all exciting art adventures. Uh, my first trip was in 2014 for the first international pastel uh, symposium and exhibition. And I was one of five American artists invited to go, along with Richard McKinley and Jimmy Wright, Gwyneth Barth uh, White, and Jason Chang. And then there were four European artists and Isabel Lim, who's from, from uh, Hong Kong. Isabel was actually the one responsible for this. Her, along with our Chinese uh, uh, partner, who goes by the American name of Simon. Uh, this all happened in Suzhou, China, which has now become the pastel capital of the Far East, maybe of the world, because they're putting so much emphasis on pastel. So the first trip, uh, our little group toured around Suzhou and some nearby areas, and we painted a location several days, and we gave lectures and demos at the universities, and then it all ended with the grand finale of a big exhibition and symposium with well-known Chinese artists. Then the following year, I was invited to go back to have an exhibition uh, as part of the first Suzhou <laughs> Pastel International Festival. That might not be exactly right, but that's pretty much what it is. So I had, an, uh, I had a one-man exhibition along with the uh, Pastel Society of France had an exhibition, and the Chinese artists had an exhibition. And I also brought uh, eight American artists with me, and I taught a workshop while I was doing that. So I was teaching American students. Then in 2016, they invited me back as part of a program uh, in Suzhou and in, in Beijing, uh, where we were teaching uh, Chinese art teachers. So I spent a month in Suzhou and in Beijing with Isabel Lin, uh, Lim, uh, Kong Wen, and Ellen Eagle. And we taught in Suzhou and then we went to Beijing and taught. So it was really an exciting adventure. And the Chinese uh, culture is so interesting and the people are so kind uh, and uh, so hospitable that, uh, you know, it's just been a pleasure every time we've been here to experience the, both the ancient Chinese culture uh, in, the, uh, in the ancient villages, so-called water villages, then in Beijing to see you know, the major sites, the Great Wall, the, uh, the uh, summer gardens, uh, you know, and so on. So it's just been an exciting time. So it's something that I, I really, really cherish over, over this time. Thank you so much for sharing that with us, Alan. You're welcome. I appreciate it.